I'm in South and I'm reacting to the Borderlands trailer and I have a Borderlands expert with me and I'm somebody who has never seen or played a Borderlands. So ever? Ever. Not one. Never one. So I'm a Borderlands expert, uh, as Mince Howard mentioned. I, uh, my first game was actually Borderlands, the original one. I played mm. Mordecai, the sniper character. I did not beat the game in that function. But since then, I played Borderlands 2. And I've beat Borderlands 2 in all kinds of different ways. Uh, I've then also played Borderlands the pre-sequel, which introduces lasers and all kinds of other, you know, crazy action skills. Also beat that in all kinds of different ways. Are there any more Borderlands after that? There's Borderlands 3, actually. You wouldn't believe it. Oh, there's a third one. There's a third one. Did you play that one? Yeah, and it sucks. Okay. It really, really sucks. Hot take. Well, no, it's not. It's not a hot take? Because here, here's my, I would say, lukewarm take. Okay. Borderlands 3 is a really fun shooter game. Okay. Ruined by the dialogue. All right. Um, in Borderlands 2, like, you know, I have probably 200 hours, which might not be that spectacular for a lot of people, but on Borderlands 2. 200 hours, that something makes you an expert. There's something like that. Yeah. I don't know. But, uh, are you uh, excited to watch this movie? No, not trailer? at all. I've seen this trailer. I have not. I will be point blank honest with you. This trailer makes me flaccid. Oh, well. Just straight out flaccid uh, let's... for what's coming out in Borderlands. I'm not excited. It looks bad. Well, I have no idea what it looks like, so we're about to watch it in three, two, one, go. Feel freaking load. Trailer! Trailer starts, starts now. Wait, so, Marvel did this, and now Borderlands is doing this? Well, and that's the other thing, too. Between the trailer <laughs> and starts, they showed Krieg, and Krieg is the mentally ill character. Okay. So Krieg is the psychopath that you can take in Borderlands 2. All um, right. I think it's kind of silly that they're taking him as a perspective that you can play through. Because um, it's heavily implied that he's Tiny Tina's daughter. Or rather, Krieg is Tiny Tina's dad, rather, is what I mean. Okay. Um, and just overall, I think it's fucked because they're using Tiny Tina as a character. I don't know. This movie does not inspire wanting to watch it. Well, let's watch this trailer. I hate this planet. Wow, edgy. Yeah, you're supposed to. It's the worst. Would you look at that? Wow, comedy. Yeah, Jack Black is Claptrap, the most hated character in all of Borderlands. Well, at least cool. she has bunny ears. Isn't that adorable? No, it's not. Because it's something you can do. I am... Is that Kevin Hart there? That's yes. Kevin Hart. Okay. Kevin Hart as Roland is actually the most offensive part to me, I think. Because Roland is supposed to be a really serious guy. Okay, and Kevin Hart's doing it like a lighthearted dude. Yeah. Okay. And I, I mean, I'll be serious. I don't even think Kevin Hart can't do like serious dudes. I just don't think he's doing it for this. Do you know that legend has it that there's this massive? There's this massive what? Treasure, treasure hunting? Is that what Borderlands is about? Is treasure hunting? Just quite a question. Yes. I, okay, good to know. And he's got like a Scooby-Doo van. And do you know what the treasure always turns out to be? Friendship? No, uh, c uh, uh, hmm, what's his name? Cthulhu. Oh, that's a treasure. It's like, uh, it's a bunch of tentacles that turn out to want to kill you, usually in Borderlands. Let's kill ourselves with this trailer, shall we? I already have, multiple times, because I really wanted this movie to be good. There's a dragon guy. It's on the weirdest, most dangerous dumpster fire. Lilith is maybe 28. I feel like they're doing this the... This portrayal of Lilith as a 45-year-old woman is actually the most offensive thing to me. I find it... I um, feel like this is like a Mad Max ripoff, the, at least the fourth movie anyway. But with they're all that having Anna fighters. Taylor Joyce play, uh, what's her, Furiosa, right? So... Th that's what they're doing with Mad Max, but I think like Lilith as a really old woman, 45 years, that's 
it's taking away from her character because everyone in Borderlands, all of the main characters that you can play as, the point of them is they're going to die. Ah. So why would you be playing as a character who's been alive for so long? Like, even in the third Borderlands game, where Lilith is kind of the leader of things, she's maybe 40. Maybe she, like, aged this poorly. Is... I'm not sure based on the trailer where they're putting this Borderland series. Mm. But everything I've seen of it pisses me off because Roland's still alive. I, I don't think they know what they're doing. But it's from the producer of Uncharted. I don't care. Uncharted was a shitty ass movie. We're literally in a Papa John's right now. Oh, great. Mint, mint. We're literally, you know, you look above us, there's a Papa John's right there. That's what we're working with. We're literally in a Papa John's right now. Yes, there's a lot of pizzas being made around us, but uh, uh, they should have made pizzas instead of this movie. Watch, watch this. Made this movie. What do you think it's called? Piss wash. I'm gonna get the name. It's in my mouth. I don't care. Wow, this looks boring. So actually, my biggest complaint with this movie, now that I'm realizing it, and we're. Only not even halfway into the trailer. Zero, the best character from Borderlands 2, is not involved in it at all. And who is that? Uh, Zero's like the sniper assassin character. Okay. Um, and that's it. He's a sniper assassin. He's got the only melee build for the four. I mean, they're not doing it well. Doesn't look like it. Wait, 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 wait. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna bring up death with this jovial music behind it? That's very, uh, tone that, depth. I will say, that is very Borderlands. Okay. Um, death is a very jovial experience. In they should have made it more jovial then, because this is kind of uncanny for me. So they should have gone, ooga chaka. Yeah, ooga, they should have been like, they should have been like dancing around a guy who's being hung while there's like, feeling. yeah, that song is being played and they're all dancing. Deep inside they should have done me. that, honestly, instead of just like, oh, look how many people died looking That's for this That's what you're ball. saying, it should have been Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah, pretty much. Mm. Should have been that. Something they don't, baby girl. Ew. What? Right? Lilith is supposed to be a sex icon, and she's a 45 year old woman. And I mean, no offense to the person playing Lilith. I don't know who she is, I have no context for it. But that's not who Lilith is supposed to be. Did you see the cleavage shot in there, though? No, I didn't. Well, they, they, it was like a, a split second. Be -be -be bang. I didn't see cleavage. With your body parts. Oh, and that's the other thing. Tiny Tina. Tiny Tina is fucking ruined with this. What is she supposed to be like? Um, she's an insane. She's literally insane. In when you're going through the Borderlands two and Borderlands, I don't think she's in the first one, but the second one, she's just literally an insane bombs expert. Hmm. And you just go to her because she knows how to build bombs. All right. Uh, it, I hate her quest line in Borderlands 2. I'll say that. My right impression of her it has to be like, oh, we're going to spray body parts all over you. And Are you excited for the Borderlands 2 or Borderlands movie? I'll, That's I'll, my big I'll share question. my opinion after this trailer is up. But I'll have to say uh, sh she should sound more insane instead of just like an adult trying to do a child voice. If, or, if she's insane, like in the... She is. If she's insane, she should sound more insane. She should sound like the Joker insane. And this doesn't really convey it at all. What did I tell you? Minimal no, I said no Bunny ears. ears. That's the person I'm talking about. Bang, bang. Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart is not a good roller. Okay, so we have Jack Black as Claptrap. Is it because is uh, because he's annoying? That's it. Claptrap is annoying. They they probably gave Jack Black the role because it name rhymes with his name, Jack Black. Claptrap. Yeah. Sure. I I hate that analysis of it, but I would believe that it happened. But... Yeah. Claptrap is the worst character. Jamie Lee Curtis. She's t so actually, I forgot about that. 
She's Tannis, and that pisses me off a lot. Because Jamie Lee Curtis is like... 70 know, or 60 or whatever. 70 or 60. Tannis is maybe 40. Oh. Maybe. Tannis is supposed to be fuckable. I mean, it d depends on your definition of fuckable. She's fuckable to some people. Yeah, she Like did, fans of Halloween. She would accept alien races to piss on her. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm saying. She would accept the piss. Let's continue. Why would you ask for it? Mm. Wow. I I think my biggest problem with this is it makes me feel a lot like the the Telltale Borderlands things did, which is we lost a major character, uh, Scooter, in the Telltale ones. Yeah. But I don't feel like I really did. I don't feel like it matters. I don't feel like this movie is going to matter. It doesn't... This movie, it doesn't feel like it really appreciates the games, which is stupid, and I appreciate that. It doesn't even feel like an interesting movie. They just show, they show everything in the trailer while wow, they're going to go yeah. to this guy and shoot him. They're gonna shoot going to shoot a lot of people. Uh, mark my words, whoever is making this movie, I'm going to pirate this. Fuck you. I I'm disavow crimes. In a theater. I would never commit a crime, but I will pirate this. Ah, the scream. What was that? That's not a thing in Borderlands. What was that? It, that looks cool, though. Yeah, it looks great. That was great. cool. What that was the, the coolest was thing. It? That's not been a thing. Fuck you. If that's not a thing I've fought in a Borderlands game, fuck you. There's plenty of fucking huge machines that you could implement there. And I'm really mad you didn't. Um, as a, like, Borderlands genuinely is my hard in to gaming. And to see something like this, where it's so fucked up of Kevin Hart being Roland... And I genuinely have no ill will against Kevin Hart. But Roland is supposed to be a really serious character. And I don't think Kevin Hart communicates that. He's a comedian. Exactly. I like Kevin Hart's comedy, but he's not communicating what Roland's supposed to be. And I get it. Kevin Hart is also trying to pivot into a very hard, serious, like... Dramatic. Dramatic role now. But this is not... The way, I mean, and, oh, God, I don't know who Lilith is played by. Oh, God, let's see, Kate let's Blanchett, see. Kate I think. I could be wrong. Yeah, let's see. It's not good. It's not communicated well. I oh, gross. I'm going to be com uh, straight up 100% honest. I saw Dune 2 and was really annoyed. This that, is... But I was really annoyed in Dune 2 that Aunt Taylor Joyce got bought, brought up. But her is Lilith. I would take that way over whoever they've chosen to portray Lilith. I just saw... Uh, I know it's like a machine or whatever the heck, but that's, that's shit humor. What are you talking about? I don't pre... Ooh. Check this out. What's happening right now? I'm expelling the excess lead. Oh, the robot is shitting. Yep. Yeah. Isn't that great that they got Jack Black? They paid Jack Black a million dollars to shit. I don't know how much money it is. I'll be honest. But they paid Jack Black. We gotta finish this. Coming soon. This trailer did not... In I'm like a hardcore Borderlands fan. I bought all of the games. I've played all of the games. It was my first game ever, really. And this movie trailer is not inspiring to me this looks really boring it doesn't it like i'm so i'm so glad we're next for you to talk about it because it's just like it doesn't appeal to experts of borderland and it doesn't appeal to somebody who knows nothing about the series like i don't care about this whatsoever it's just a stupid pity grab movie yeah it, it's very obvious because you can you got big old actors like Kate Blanchett. I don't know who she is personally, but who I do know. Who care? She's too old to be Lily. But I do know. Oh, I do know Kevin Hart and Jack Black. 
Those are big names. Well, and so I'll be honest. I think Jack Black as Claptrap is a really good casting. But I think Kevin Hart as Roland is the worst casting you could possibly aim for. Because Roland is supposed to be a really serious guy. Um, and I know Kevin Hart's been trying to, like, leverage into that a little more. But I don't think it works out as well as he'd like it to. Jack Black has always kind of been on, like, the weird cusp of, like, being fun. Yeah. Because Claptrap, in every single game, you want to kill. And they and made a joke there in the trailer about wanting to, sh like, shooting him, and he never died. So there's that. There's just too many of them. <sighs> what there's would you rate this trailer? The trailer? Yeah. Oh, God. Uh, 10 out of 10? You think it's a 10 out of 10, but you hate the trailer and it looks terrible. Well, no, no. It, it's out of 10. I'm just clarifying the scale. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yes. Sorry, I thought you said giving One. it a 10 out of 10. Okay. I mean, like... If I can I do negatives? Sure, go ahead. Negative six. Negative six. Out of ten. This is I wanted a Borderlands movie, to be completely honest with you. I wanted it to be fun. I wanted it to be campy. I wanted it to be cool. But they did it wrong. Like, okay, so right They did. Like Kevin Hart Roland. That's I, I, I do think that's one of my biggest problems. Kevin Hart's too campy for Roland. Roland's a serious, like, marine ass guy. So who would I want instead of Kevin Hart? That uh, I'm posing my own questions on myself. Um, hmm. I'm only thinking of dead guys right now. That's a problem. Better than Kevin Hart. For like a, a serious military guy. Tom Is Cruise. I'd rather have <laughs> Tom Cruise than Kevin Hart. Not gonna lie. That is incredibly controversial. I mean, I he it. would, he would, uh, he would do the stunts. He would. He, there'd be more intense stunts if uh, Tom Cruise was involved in this movie. It'd be cooler as a result. So, that has been our trailer reaction to Borderlands. Are you going to see this movie? Are you going to boycott this movie? Let me know in the comments below. Boycott this movie. This is my words as bird stored expert watch anime expert of borderlands do not watch this movie it will be bad watch this movie after you watch a different movie and you sneak yourself into the other movie don't waste your time on this movie i think i'd give this personally like a solid five out of ten it just waste looks really your mid. time on this movie but sneak into it all right where can we promote you Promote me? Yeah. I am at uh, B-I-R-D-S-T-O-R-C B-I-R-D-S-T-O-R-C on Twitter and Instagram. And that's pretty much it. Alright, well, uh, if you want to help support the daily grindiness of all the daily movie, movie support reviews. Support her. I do daily She's movie reviews. Supporting. I do daily movie sure. reviews. YouTube.com slash ASC presents your here. So go check out my daily movie reviews if you want to. How many daily movie reviews do you do? Just one? One daily movie review per day. Yes. And what comes along with that? A movie review at 7 p.m. ET every day. But do you day. get any, like, let's say you give you, you another five or ten dollars. What do you get with that potential? Well, if you want to request a movie review, I do that for $20. Redo you know is at patreon.com slash Presents. And if you want to help for daily grindiness of all them daily movie reviews, go to this link tree. Find the way you can help support the daily grind of all them daily movie reviews. And until next time, Min Salad Saw, this is not Min Salad Saw. Next time I review a trailer, I'll see you later, my salad croutons and bacon bits. Fuck you, Borderlands 2 creators.